That perfect looking apple in your grocery cart might actually be older than the iPhone you're holding. Some fresh apples sit in storage for up to 14 months before reaching shelves. But I bet you didn't know that's just the beginning of why supermarket fruit tastes like cardboard compared to what your grandparents ate. Here's what will blow your mind. Scientists have discovered that modern commercial fruit contains up to 40% less protein, 15% less calcium, and 38% less riboflavin than produce from the 1950s. And that's before we even talk about what happened to the taste. Modern commercial fruit breeding prioritizes six things before flavor, appearance, size, yield, disease resistance, shelf life, and shipping durability. Flavor ranks seventh at best and sometimes isn't considered at all. But here's the twisted truth. When plants are bred for higher sugar content, they actually become less nutritious. A study published in Hort Science found that as fruits get sweeter, they lose essential minerals. It's called the dilution effect. Meanwhile, modern strawberries contain 35% fewer aromatic compounds than 50 years ago, while some tomato varieties have only 4% of the taste compounds found in heirloom varieties. The red delicious apple is the perfect cautionary tale. Originally called Hawkeye, it was progressively bred for deeper red color and thicker skin to survive shipping, but each generation became more mealy and tasteless, despite looking absolutely perfect. Here's where the deception gets worse. Fruit develops most of its flavor during the final ripening stages on the plant, but commercial fruits are harvested while still hard and unripe to survive processing and shipping. Bananas are picked so unripe they're technically still vegetables when harvested. They haven't developed the sugars that make them fruit yet. Tomatoes are picked completely green and hard, then artificially ripened with ethylene gas during transport. This gas triggers color change but develops almost none of the complex flavor compounds that natural ripening would create. But here's the truly criminal part. Strawberries lose 60% of their vitamin C within just three days of harvest, yet they travel over 1,500 miles and sit for a week or more before you buy them. Even worse, just one day of refrigeration permanently reduces flavor compounds by up to 40% because cold temperatures irreversibly damage the cellular structures that produce taste. Think fresh means recently harvested? Here's the reality check. Apples can be stored for up to 14 months in controlled atmosphere warehouses that suspend ripening using nitrogen gas. That fresh apple you bought in July might have been picked the previous summer. These facilities control oxygen levels down to 1 to 2% compared to 21% in normal air, creating a state of suspended animation. While this ensures year-round availability, the fruit never develops its full flavor potential and actually loses aromatic compounds during extended storage. Here's the most infuriating part. The technology exists to maintain both freshness and flavor, but it costs more. Smart Fresh technology uses 1-methylcyclopropene to block ethylene production, maintaining taste while extending shelf life, but retailers won't pay the extra 10 cents per apple because consumers can't detect flavor until after purchase. So how do you find fruit that actually tastes like fruit? First, seek out farmer's markets where varieties are selected for flavor, not shipping. Seasonality matters enormously. In-season local fruit will almost always destroy supermarket options. Look for ugly fruit, irregular shapes, and slight blemishes often indicate varieties bred for flavor rather than appearance. Some supermarkets now offer heirloom varieties as specialty items. They cost more, but deliver the taste you remember fruit having. Here's a pro tip. Never refrigerate tomatoes, stone fruits, or avocados at home. It permanently damages their flavor cells. And let fruit ripen at room temperature to maximize whatever flavor potential remains. Counter ripening for just two to three days can double the sugar content of commercially harvested fruit. The next time you bite into a flavorless peach or tasteless strawberry, remember that it's not your imagination. You're experiencing the result of an entire industry that spent decades perfecting beautiful fruit that delivers zero satisfaction. But now you know how to fight back and find fruit that actually delivers on the promise of flavor. If this revelation changed how you'll shop forever, hit subscribe for more videos that expose the truth behind everyday experiences.